This is KMTV 3 News Now. I'm Jennifer Griswold with 3 News Now, and here's a look at what's happening now. Governor Pete Ricketts and Democratic challenger Senator Bob Christ squared off in their first and possibly only debate this afternoon. Both candidates were not afraid to take shots at each other over issues such as property taxes, corrections reform, and Medicaid expansion in front of a large crowd at the State Fair in Grand Island. On the issue of property taxes, Christ and Ricketts both said they need to be cut, but disagreed on how to do it. The debate was sponsored by 3 News Now and our partner, the Omaha World Herald. A judge set bond at $1 million for a Bellevue police officer who reported that his girlfriend had killed herself. 52-year-old Craig Weish called police Sunday night after he says 48-year-old Carrie Brown shot herself at his home near 189th and L Streets. Weish faces attempted assault on an officer charges for allegedly hitting an Omaha police officer and trying to punch a firefighter. The circumstances surrounding Brown's death are still under investigation. Weish is currently on administrative leave. And I'm 3 News Now. Weather alert meteorologist Jennifer Seppin with this latest weather update. Chances for rain will start to pick up later in the evening, but overall it's just a very isolated chance of a spotty shower and maybe even an isolated thunderstorm. So most of the area will stay dry for this evening and looking at temperatures in the morning, much warmer of 70 degrees. Big warm up though for Friday with a temperature of 88 in the afternoon. A little mix of clouds and sunshine, slight chance of a shower or thunderstorm, but it looks like some of the heaviest activity will start to develop late in the evening on Friday. Day and it looks like the chances only continue to keep going up as we head into the holiday weekend. Looks like it could impact at least game time. Seven o'clock kickoff for the Huskers game in Lincoln. Better chances for some showers and thunderstorms developing late in the evening. Decent chance for some scattered activity on Sunday and we keep that chance of rain around for most of next week.